Harvest's room. I'm harvesting Alabama Duffers from my outdoors worm bin. Ah, good. So this is dirt that we dug up from the outdoor worm bed. And we'll sorting it for worms. And when we're done, what will we do with it, boy? We will put them in a bin and we will try and make more Alabama. Right, but the dirt itself we'll just put right back in our outdoor hole, right? Yeah. And then hopefully more Alabamas will come there, right? Yeah. But there's some roots. There's some roots and rocks. We sort those out for the most part, right? Yeah. Okay, say bye, boy. Bye. So we thought Alabama jumpers were living in our yard because we would sometimes find them. So we made a special area here where we tilled up the soil to make it soft and we mixed in dry brown leaves and we put worm chow on the top. And we've been watering this area every couple days to make sure it stays moist. So today was the first time we dug through it, and what do you know, what did we find? We found at least three Alabama jumpers and some smaller worms that look like they might be baby Alabama jumpers. So what do you think about that, Will? Natural Good. worm farming. Good, and also when we came to this house, we had this big garden in the area. You um, saw right over there where our worm bins were, and we mostly saw Alabama jumpers. So in all of the other um, bins were just red riddlers. Right, so when we look in our natural garden beds, we find Alabama jumpers. So that's why we're trying to cultivate more of those, okay? Yeah. Okay, kids, what do you think? Good. Bye, I'm going to water this. Water all those strawberries and we'll bye. Yeah, here's about 50 strawberry plants that have been producing strawberries for us all season. Okay, kids, see you till next time. Bye. 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 Bye.